All right, everybody, welcome to the Studying Brew episode 1013. Yes. 1013. Uh, it is a very light uh, viewing tonight. Uh, I guess people are busy build, doing turkeys and whatnot, but we're glad to see all of you here uh, with us tonight as we get ready for the holidays going into Thanksgiving. Right, right after that is what, in the blink of an eye, Christmas. Who are all these? What am I saying? Who are this guy just telling us about holidays? It's me. It's Andy. I'm the guy that runs the back office over here at Kona Butterflies. Trying to get some sleep and tired. I'm so tired. Guys, there's so much going on. But you know what? We're here for you. And who are we? Well, Brandy, you already heard me. Brandy's got her Series 6, 63, 26, 65, and her Series 7, which makes her more than qualified to teach you all the things you need to know. So that way you too can get a pass notice. And we are going to work on that tonight. Tonight, what are we doing, Brandy? Oh, test taking technique. That's you, Brandy. <laughs> test taking technique. We're going to do some more test taking techniques. Yay. It's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. We're going to keep it fast, light, because I know there's a lot of people out there that just got to get back to the cooking. Maybe you're hearing this on the replay, getting up in the morning, doing your job, putting turkeys in, whatever you got to do, and, uh, you know, getting ready for the big day. Big day. Big bird day. Uh, this is what I'm going to say. Uh, during the holidays, it does get hectic. It does get a little uh, fast and loose with, uh, with, all the with all the activities and all the things going on. But here's the thing. You got to get your study on and you got to get it on early guys, get it done early, get That's it done fun. early, get your walk, go, go do something in the morning, stretch, whatever you got to do, and then get to studying, get it over with, and then be done with it. The reason why people don't study during the holidays most times is because they go, we don't have, I don't have time. I don't have time. Oh. So much going on. I'm so busy. I'm so tired. I'm so this. I'm so that. I don't know. Nah, nah. You don't get it. And here comes January. I uh, wish I would have stayed with it. I'm working on my. I gotta get back. I got it on news list. I want to get back to it and see if I can get studied. And and it, it, and it's that half commitment again. Stay committed all the way through. Yeah. Commitments and goals should not stop because of the holidays. They don't stop for the people who are winning. They never stop. They never stop. The commitment level never ceases no matter what is on the calendar never most people win because they keep that commitment they keep that discipline most people lose because they don't they stay comfortable they disconnect they do what they can they give it their best they do the try look we all want to do our best every day, but there's an attitude and there's a little bit of a uh, lack, lax kind of a kind of lax kind of behavior that goes on when we go, oh, I did my best. Well, that was the best I can do. Hey, I hate to, to break it to you guys. And I know this sounds like old man going, I didn't get no participation trophy. Listen, in life, there is no participation trophies. And you all know that, right? Mm -hmm. No one gives a rip. They don't go, hey, you know, so glad you showed up, Tim. Here's a participation trophy. No, they're like, this is what you're supposed to do every day. Right? That's what you're supposed to do. And that's why we stay where we're at, because we just do what we're supposed to do. If you want to go above and beyond, then you level up. If you push yourself past the tiredness, past the things that are on the calendar, Past all the, you know, the things you got going on with the kids and all the other sporting events, maybe you're, you're 20 and single and you're missing out on going to the, this function and that function. Maybe you're missing out on seeing Posty this weekend, whatever it is. These are all choices that will propel you to go up because you made a commitment to something that's bigger, to the bigger goal, to something that's not something that most people are willing to do. And most people are not willing to get on at a 10 o'clock on a Wednesday, the Thanksgiving, you know, right before Thanksgiving, or they, they put their study on, on pause or whatever. Most people are not willing to just go through it and just keep it going. And no matter what happens, just keep that study moment, momentum going. Oh, it's boring. It's this, it's that. Guys, it's boring and it sucks because you make it boring and suck. You've made a conscientious decision to make this boring and suck. And we're here to tell you, if you haven't been on here before and you haven't seen us before, if this is boring and suck, it's because you haven't been tuned into Kona because there's no boringness over here. Nope. We try to make this thing fun. We try to make it relatable. 
We try to keep give you guys some hints and tricks and te- tips, you know, so you can learn stuff with techniques. You're not bogged down with all this content after hours after hours and hours of boring content. We're showing you how to master exams, and we're going to do it again tonight with the techniques and how to do that. All that great stuff. By the way, Brandy just dropped the links in the chat. There's also the gift of Kona. If you want to gift Kona and you want to get this thing going, guys, we're heading into December. It is the get- day of the month of gifting. Get on to the Kona. Guys, I know what our prices are, and I know that for the price of like a dinner out, that's what you can get Kona for. It is a whole bunch of content, education, learning, getting the tips, tricks, and techniques, getting a, you know a community behind you, getting the study on for as little as a dinner out. Make some ramen one night, for goodness sakes. Stay in. Boom. Yeah. Kona's paid for. You know what I mean? I know that we like to go out and we like to be out there and we like to do this and that, but it does take sometimes some some uh, some little bit of sacrificing. Um, we might not get to go to that dinner. We might not get to go see that newest movie in the theater. We might not get to go see Ariana Grande as Wicked. Yep. We'll spend more money on the movies than we'll spend on ourselves or invest in ourselves and getting us to the other level. We will spend more time in a movie theater, most people, uh, than we will learning or taking a quiz. We will spend more time in December watching Christmas movies and binging on Netflix than to watch some content on how to like study for these exams. That's facts. Most people will be like, I don't have time, but I'll sit there and watch like, you know, you know, Christmas with the cranks, Christmas with the crank. I'll be watching elf for this five times, 20 times, time, you know, I'll be watching the Christmas story. I wonder how that turns out. Does he shoot his eye out? <laughs> no spoiler alerts. Nope. I'm just telling you guys, there's so many things that we use to waste our times during this month and say we don't have time, then we actually we actually do really have time. It's just something we're not willing to do in December for some reason. And then we're backed up in spring. Yep. Get on to some course videos. Get the live sessions going. Be checked in with Brandy in December. Get small group tutoring. Get a, uh, on to the, the, get a study guide. SIE 663. It's all there. It's available. Guys, 951-290-3077. Give me a call. Give me a text. Also, we got the Kona Discord. It never sleeps. Uh, you can go ahead and message and post on there all you want. Uh, we'll be helping out people. Brandy's always checking in. Like tomorrow, we're not going to be on any of the sessions. Nope. But do you know what we're going to be doing? We're going to be checking in that Discord. Yeah, we will. Brandy's going to be looking over there. She's going to see. She's going to be like Santa Claus, seeing who's uh, who needs help. You know what I mean? I'm going to say like naughty or nice list. Or not naughty. But who's a studier and who's not, right? Mm-hmm. Get on there. Uh, check it out. Uh, you never know what Brandy's able to do over there. She might be able to give you guys some, uh, some, you know, some great help for, uh, maybe it's free. Yeah. I'm just saying if you pay though. Yeah. Get a lot more attention. That's true. That's the way it works. Yeah. All right. Just a reminder tomorrow, uh, Thursday, Thanksgiving and Friday, no sessions at all. We're not having any member sessions. We're not having the studying brew. None of that stuff. Be with you, yours. Uh, you and yours, right? Yes. And uh, take 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 some time to reflect. Yes. Be be counting those blessings as long and uh, just as long as you know, as long as you keep the studying in there. That's right. Count the blessings. Count the turkey parts you eat. I don't know whatever it is you do, <laughs> but but keep that studying in there. Yes, right, please. All right. Um, we got Kona. We got the audio. Yeah. Speaking of, if you are just like doing stuff in the kitchen all day tomorrow. What a great way to like do that by just uh, tuning in to some of the audio that is now on Spotify as well. Uh, we got that all partnered up. All you got to do is connect the two uh, accounts and you're in. Yay. All right, everybody. If you're not following us on Instagram, I wish you would. I tell you what, because when they give me a picture yeah, and they let me know. Yeah. Guess what, Brandy? What's up? We add another one to the Kona Hall of Fame because we got a passer. Yes, we do. We got a passer. Congratulations, congratulations to Kathy Shields. Get that S I E N. Uh she um she did tell us. Yeah. Well, I'll just go ahead and tell you what she said. But we are so proud and uh we are honored to be the one that helped you push uh, push you over that uh that that hill, yes. that mountain that uh get you to that next level and help you get that S I E done. And uh congratulations. What uh, Kathy said is I've tried a couple of other study options. We weren't the first. No. That's okay. That's and good. couldn't pass the test. Got you. But once I had Brandy's way, 
I was able to pass. Oh, wait, she said it like this. I was able to pass explanation point. Yes. All right. A little bit more sauce on that. So thankful to have to have had all of Brandy's help. Looking forward to Brandy helping me pass the series six. Gotcha. Yes, let's go. Let's get that series six. I'm telling you guys, we're different than everybody else. We're not doing the same old, same old. And I'm glad this worked out for you, Kathy. And you you understood there's a way and uh, you tuned in, you got locked in, you did it the Brandy way and you got that SIE monkey right off your back. And we're on to the series six. We're on to the six. And you know what you're going to find out when you get into the six, when you've done it the Brandy way? What's up? You're almost more than halfway there through the six. You you only got a very little bit of studying and we're getting that pass notice for the six. Yes. Well, why? Why? Because Kona, all we do is uh, stack pass notices. That's right. And we're going to get that stack going. So congratulations on getting this thing done. What a way. What a way to get to Thanksgiving. Can, can I say it, it was really cute because um, I, I logged on at 930 this morning. I, I did step away from the computer, so I didn't see that she had actually sent a message and said, I can't be on today. But I just wanted to let you know that I passed. Woohoo! And then she was gone. <laughs> it was like that fast. It was so cool. Like I she probably yeah. logged in right after she took the exam because she did uh, remote testing. Yeah. Uh, she qualified to do remote testing. So she got it done at home. Awesome. Um, remote testing, I will say this. We don't always recommend it, but it is a um, it is a possibility. It's option. It is an option and uh, it does work. Yeah. Um, but if you ever have any questions about remote testing, which she did have some questions and she reached out and uh, she was able to make it work. So if you have any questions, let us know. Uh, we're not saying don't take it. Go. No, um, but I think you have to be prepared. Yes. And aware. Yes. And then it's a little different. And that's it. Yep. Go get go get it. Heck yeah. Go get it. Woo. All right. Let's get on to it. Let's do the test taking techniques. Much like test taking techniques Tuesday. This is uh, as Joanna put it. Wisdom Wednesday. Yes. Wisdom Wednesday is the same as test taking techniques Tuesday. In fact, we got the same rules. Rule number one, you're not allowed to ask what exam did that question come from? It's irrelevant. It's irrelevant. I'm gonna it doesn't stretch. matter. I'm going to stretch it to you. Don't ask the content or where the quizzes came from at all. Don't ask content or where the quizzes come from at all. Go at this totally blind as if you know nothing. Nothing. Guys, I know there's a there's a few um study preps that are right like um it's funny because they 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 watch us. I I I I see you. They're like we're going to show them how that test taking techniques doesn't work. Right, as if it's you. As if it's that brand. There it this is listen. Listen to every listen to me every uh one of you test the studying prep people that are watching secretly in your closet. Mm. Uh Listen, these apply to the real exam. Not We're not trying to master your Q bank fool. We don't care about your Q bank. Because it doesn't matter. Your Q bank don't matter. It's just practice. Yeah. Just practice, y'all. Because the real exam is the one we want. Because that's the one where you get a pass notice. And these work on the real exam fool. Yeah. I like that. There we go. Thank you. Got it. Thanks, man. Got you. All right. Rule number two. How do we get good at anything? We just practice. We practice. You practice. And you practice some more. Don't be an Allen Iverson. You want to be good at this. You want to add this to your arsenal and then bam, there you are. There you Mastering are. another thing that can be great, that can be easily in your arsenal and helping you pass these exams. You ready to go? I'm ready. I think that's what Kathy did. She said the brandy way. If you're doing brandy the brandy way. way, you're doing this right here. That's right. You guys ready? I'm ready. Let's do it. All right. <clears throat> I got reorganization, reorganization, reorganization. Liquidation is different. Boom. Not even that, Diana. Look at that. Even easier. Yeah. Um. I, when I took the when I took these quizzes, I'm not gonna lie. I was not at home, and I was very distracted. Super. And I still did that. Super distracted. Yeah. I did that. Switch the screen. I feel like sometimes you put the screen on there way too long and people read the question anyway. Okay, so next screen? Yeah, I don't want them to read it. Okay, next screen. The effective date, the time of which the SEC approves the securities, the exu date? Um, <laughs> the due date. <laughs> I feel like somebody made that up. I don't know why, but I saw that and I saw that, right? Uh-huh. And so I, I said, hey, because that's a real word. That, yeah, this is this is real, right? This is real. The 
the I don't know what that is. The due date is the end, right? Yeah. Okay. This is my hint, right? That we're talking about starting. Yeah. Da, da, da. What is that? I don't know. So that is the answer because it's a really simple question. All right, let's go on to the next one. I think people read the question and then they try to figure out what content. I'm I, I'm tired of it, Brandy. Got it. They got to do it our way. Look at this horrible, 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 horrible thing. I want you guys to know I read none of this. I looked at this and said, Ooh, this is pretty long. Yep. I looked at the question and saw that this was not a peer. And I said, please a. listen to this. I said, I'm all, please, Lord, please say it. C, because I don't want to read anything. Oh, not way too long. And guess what, guys? I went. I clicked on C and I went, <laughs> because you know why? It said not. That's too many ones and there's 0.25s and there's a two and there's a however and a two. What is that? Right. I don't want that in a contract. Right, right. right. Yeah. Period. And I'm not even talking about the content yeah. of it. Just I, yeah. The ones, the twos, the threes, the howevers. I stipulation, double yeah. I stipulation. Stop, stop. Get out of my contract. Weird. Yeah. What's the answer? Uh, hey. It's the only one with no strategy attached to it. Should we see the question real quick and then move on? All right, let's go. Tell the question all you want. That's <laughs> not how you answered it. That is not how I answered it. You just went A and then moved on. Yeah. Okay. So um, this one did take a little bit more That's thought. That's the brandy way. That is the brandy way. Okay, so I have um, the investment advisor, no place. The investment advisor has 80 million. The investment advisor is headquartered outside the US. The advisor is federally covered. Boom, boom. I looked at this and, uh, I, okay. That looks long, but to be quite honest, it's because it's just bunched up in the corner. It's actually not a long question. Um, advisor legally conducts, so I legally conducts business in the state without registration or notice filing, which of the following could do, the, do could be a reason for this, right? Why could you do this and be able to? I looked at the fact that they're outside the U.S., they have no business in the U.S., and they have 10 clients. So that is why I pick C. You got less, the magic number, by the way. Just a little bit of content on this one. Not really. Not really. I just said, no, like, where you how could you do business in the United States, but not register? You're, you're not in the U S yeah. The 10 client thing is little content. Yeah. The little content and that, that I'm going to tell you guys, hint, hint, hint is that 10 clients seems to be a magic number. That's it. It's just a magic, it's a magic number. number. Yeah. That's it. 10 clients. All right. Next one. That's it. Oh wait, no, I do have one more. Oh, I do. Have okay. So because it was a risk question and I had to. You have to do it. Okay. So I got default, which means no payments. Like you didn't make your payment. Uh, market risk is the whole thing. The liquidity risk is not sell. And interest rate risk has to do something with um, like, um, what do I want to say? Um, like coupons. Yep. Like coupons, um, bonds, debt. That's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for debt. Sorry. That, not the coupon, the debt part. And it's a magic number. Uh, a diversified portfolio contains U.S. government issued fixed income securities. What's the risk? Greatest concern for the securities in this diversified portfolio? Um, this is a 65 question. That's why it's all wordy like that. Um, so I'm going to tell you that um, because it's government, I don't have to fear default. It's just one type. So I don't have to fear the full because these are government. I it's easy to sell so it's not a big deal so it has to be that one by process of elimination boom boom there you go that's fast that was it that's it that's it that's last that's like brandy way yeah. we did it that is we knocked it out and i used two different brands two different brands same of techniques so if you're a study prepper watching us in your closet taking notes on how we do it changing that up it doesn't matter we work with all of them that's right. Work with all of them. Techniques apply to all of all them. them. All of them. All of them. All of them. It doesn't matter. Nice try. It mm -hmm. works on the real exam. Just ask Kathy. It's not cheating either. Just ask Kathy. Yeah, we don't have the answers to. We do. We do not say we have the answers to the exam. No. Do you know if someone actually is promoted and said they have the actual answers to the exam? 
Finra, I hope you're watching. Every, yeah, go watch them. Go watch them. Don't watch me. Yeah, we don't have the answers to the exam. What we do have is techniques. That's right. We got keywords. Teach you how to read. We got techniques. We got ways to help you guys get the pass notice. And what are we talking about? Pass notices. Pass. We're so happy to have you guys here. You guys all have a great Thanksgiving. Count your blessings. Be grateful. Be happy for all that is around you tomorrow. And if you don't have anybody to be with, reach out. Reach out, reach out to somebody. Study with somebody. Don't be alone. There's plenty of people out there that need you, that love you. And uh, and if you're in that in that dark space because you're missing some people, look at all the people that are there. Be around them. Love on them. Tomorrow's not guaranteed either our securities, right? Count all the positivity in your life. Take an inventory and just really say a prayer for it. Even if you're not into the turkey and all that stuff, we can all have a day of grace and a day of thankfulness and just be happy to be alive and to be on this planet another day and to be around the people that we love and that love us, right? Right. So uh, one of my things that I like to do before a holiday and just reminder Listen, no matter what happens tomorrow, I don't care what it is, if you are drinking, if you are under the influence of, uh, you know, a little bit of a green cabbage, a little smoky smoke. Hey, I ain't judging you. Gardening. But I'm saying, if you're impaired in any way, don't get behind the wheel. Behind this, in this, in this time and era, there's plenty of ways to get home safely and not endanger yourself or others. So please be wise. Be smart, have fun, but be smart. Be smart about it, okay? Uh, and if you need a, a little bit of Uber cash, ask on the Discord. Maybe we'll send you a buck, buck or two. But we don't want you out on the road. Be careful, all right, everybody? Just be safe out there. As I always say, stay safe out there. Wash your hands. Don't touch your face. Don't touch your friend's face. That's all I know. Keep that positive mental attitude. PMA, everybody. Have a great night and a happy Thanksgiving. Thank you so much for being on and watching this replay. Have a happy, happy Thanksgiving. Don't forget to study. We'll see you guys next time. Have a great one.